everybody and welcome back to Had a Full Boyfriend with Jackie Nesbo. Where we last left off, we had just finished the sports festival thing and Woo. somehow it was hard for us. We somehow we didn't come in first even though we're literally the only human in the school and so like we literally I don't okay. I just, we're just really bad at running. Maybe, maybe she's like like just terrible. Maybe she's really bad cardio. You know? Yeah, it's possible, probably. Anyway, so now we're, um, we skipped ahead a month, and so, you know, we're just hanging out, so, Jackie. Yep. Mmm, today is a good day. I feel like I'm shining. Whatever the fuck that means. Uh. I wonder what I should do during break. Die. Go to the... Math class. Oh. Aww. Hold on. For a second. I think we should go to the infirmary. That's what I was thinking. Okay, let's go to the infirmary. Yes. You again! Are you ill? That was not your voice for him. What was my voice for him? It was like, quiet and creepy. Cause he's creepy. You again. Are you ill? How's that? That was that was fine. It doesn't matter. It's <laughs> Um, not exactly. I don't know why I'm here. Then why are you here? No, that's not it. It is just why are you here? That was good. I can't that was, it's okay. It's alright. You know, just do what comes naturally, okay? Just let it flow. I came here to die. I came here to <clears throat> to uh to skip class. Woo. I wanted to skip class. Get out. <laughs> Kicked out at the speed of light. I should probably take my school life more seriously. <laughs> Today's an elective day. What should I do? Math class, math class. Attend your mom. Math, math class, class, math class. Backpack, backpack. I Come always on, find Bob, myself. My oh, sorry. Everybody, let's go. I always find myself wondering what the math we learn is good for. Shut up. <laughs> same, Mint, same. Shut up! I never use math, because I'm a writer. Coo! <sighs> and now we can draw a, per a line perpendicular <laughs> to... Beautiful. <clears throat> Is this math class or nap time? It's math time. Math where all up, the cool baby. kids gather to do math some up, sick baby. math. Yo. Yes. Mint leveled up. Wisdom increased by five. Sick. I like that little sound. Oh my god, we went forward like two weeks. Yeah. Today is Tana Tanabata. Tana Tanabata. I don't know what that is. It's the the thing. <coughs> it's the where they celebrate the story of um some type of like space princess and her lover. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> There's probably a bamboo tree in the plaza this year too. I think I'll go make a wish. Yeah, let's go make a wish. Yeah, and then so you yeah, you tie a wish to like a bamboo tree. Okay. And then the princess <clears throat> will grant it for you or something like that. Okay. 
Wow, there's lots here already. Any birdie I know? This is a really cute, like, scene. It's really cute. It is. I like the art in this game. Okay. <laughs> may mother stay- oh, sorry. May mother stay healthy this year, and may my stomach get better. <laughs> Ryota. <laughs> Ooh, this one's you. Morning conference on 10th. Leave 30 minutes early. Buy another alarm clock. May I wake up on time? Nanaki. Wednesday is girlfriend's day, remember? <laughs> yeah, don't forget. What should I wish for? <clears throat> the math teacher. That is not an option, but I think we should choose rule the world from the shadows. Okay. Something my my birdie sense is tingling. I wish to take the reins of power through clever schemes and rule the world from the shadows. <laughs> and kill all who stand in my path. <laughs> and anyone else to the shadow realm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello. Is that you, Jansen? Uh, yes, it is. Obviously. I'm like the only human in the entire world. Mr. Nanaki! Hello? You should be careful out this late. It can be dangerous for a girl, you know. Are birds gonna hurt me? Yes. <laughs> they Oh, okay. I can't just this punch them across the world. I'm going back to the theory where they're like human-sized birds. Because I know that we've yeah. talked about this before. Yeah, we have. It, I think that's, that's a viable theory. Okay. <clears throat> I was about to head home. Would you like me to walk you to your place? That would be a little creepy if we weren't trying to get with him. So... Um. Yes. Yes, please. Yes, please. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> All right. Hey, hey, Jackie. What? I don't want to be your best friend anymore. What? April Fools. Ha <laughs> ha. It's April second, Isabel. Okay. There was only one good April Fool's joke, or April Fool's, that happened to me this year. Oh yeah, what's that? Mr. Tell us. Nanaki... You have to tell us the story. Monstrated some extreme sleep on the way home, but we arrived eventually. My eyes are doing some weird thing right now, and it's hard oh, to read. Okay. You have to tell us your April Fool's prank that happened to you. Well, it didn't happen to... Like, me specifically. It was on Facebook. Oh, okay. Actually, same here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it was the same thing. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we got home. Mr. Nanaki walked us home. Your house is very rustic, Johnson. Call me Mint. I like it this way. I like being able to freeze my butt on the cold stone floor. Actually, I really like caves, so I don't blame her for sleeping in one because, like, caves are super cool. <sighs> it's wonderful to have a place to come back to, isn't it? Wonderful indeed. This is my house. Excuse me. <gasps> he looks a little sad. He doesn't have a house. He's a homeless birdie. Well, he is a teacher, to be fair. He sleeps at the school. Oh my god. Um, sir, you can live with me. We just have to get married and you have to promise to love me forever. No, can we not? <laughs> We're literally tomorrow. Don't forget your homework, Jackie. Literally, <laughs> Jackie. Literally, our goal for this playthrough is to date him. Okay, know, you gotta I, accept it. I know, but it still doesn't make it any less creepy. You know, you just gotta embrace the creepiness. Just 
hold it to you, cradle it like a kitty. And so he left, a somewhat hollow-sounding farewell echoing behind him, very poetic, mint. Or was it just my imagination? Probably, you're not that good at reading people. Yeah, she, like, acts like everything's totally fine. <clears throat> Today is an elective day, what should I do? Math class. Attend. Math, Math class. class. Sir, how will integral calculus help us in life? Calculate. So they the were talking about parallel of... lines, and now they're talking about integral calculus. Um, hard to say. <laughs> hmm, it might never help you at all, Johnson. But only studying things that help you in life is tiresome. Think of it as educational candy. Mm, that taste in math. Delicious. Math is delicious. Mm -hmm. Integral calculus is educational candy? I'm not prepared to accept this. Stop that. <laughs> <clears throat> Mint leveled up. Wisdom increased by five. Do -do -do. Good job, Mint. You suck, Mint. You suck, Mints. Uh... We get our finals back today. I'm not sure I did too well. I bet we did great. I bet you did awesome, Mint. Because you've been going to math class. Yep. Jansen! Jansen! <laughs> Sir? Well done! You've gotten even better! Keep up the good work! Yeah! High five, Jackie! Ugh. Ugh. Yes, sir! Success! <laughs> <coughs> We're just flying through the school year. Yeah, we, we seriously are. Today is the last day. It's been a semester already. Jeez. Damn. We go from, like, the second day to the end of the semester. Yeah. You know, we're that good. Sometimes it seems long, and sometimes it seems short. But either way, it's summer now. And I want to spend it at school with Mr. Nanaki. Yeah. I think Sakuya said to help him clean the council room before going home. Oh, okay. I guess we could do that. He... he he always gets angry if I make him wait, so I should hurry. You're late. I came as fast as I could. Sorry, Sakia. Let's start cleaning. I don't want to clean with Sakia. Very well. First, move the shelf and chairs. There's dust underneath. Okay. Next, inside the cupboard. Arrange the files by date. Hey, um, shouldn't you be doing something? Yes, he should. Okay. And then the floor, polish it at least three times. And the window... Hold on, are you telling me to do all that by myself? Who else is there? <laughs> well, are uh, you? What about the treasurer or the clerk? Those don't exist, it's just the two of us, Jackie. Ugh. You bonehead! Yeah, Sakia, LaBelle, whatever your name is. Maybe I should stand up to him. Uh, I'm gonna say- I, I think we should say never mind. I think Mint's a little- I think we should just let her- just chill, you know? We're a human, we can handle this. Uh, He's got stupid bird wings, so he uh, can't like- He doesn't have thumbs, you know? What do you do- uh, what can you do with wings? Then how do they keep anything clean if they can't clean? Oh my god, do they have primate slaves? Have they enslaved the human race? Is that yes. why? Are we I like think, a charity I think case? They enslaved the human race, Isabel. Are we like a charity case? Like, oh, this human is a little more special. So, like, you know, just to just to keep a revolt from happening, we'll yes. let her go to school. Yes. As an example. Yes. 
to like, if you work really hard and you're as smart as us birds, you can go to school too and stop being a slave. Yes. She... I know, right? All right, I'm going to say- probably completely what happened. That's though. 100% what happened. I'm going to click never mind, okay? Okay. Well, all right, you can sit there and tell me what to do. Excellent. And so the council room was paused until it shone with the light of a thousand suns, <gasps> just as planned. Mint's a little poetic in her internal voice. Yeah. She is. Too bad she isn't this poised when speaking. Um, excuse me, what the fuck are you talking about? See, you swore. That's not very poised, is it? Uh, you can, you can be poised and say fuck. Either way. We should probably end the episode here. So this has been another episode of Powerful Boyfriend with Jackie and Isabel, and we'll catch you next time. <laughs>